Coal miners losing their jobs is a big deal. These are generational jobs in areas that don't have a lot of opportunity. And the job loss will continue in this industry. And those who wind up on the outside looking in on the inside are not going to become IT programmers. Job retraining programs do not have a high success rate. Andrew Yang understands this. Joe Biden does not. Yang also understands the job loss due to automation and that this loss will continue with advancements in robotics and artificial intelligence. Will we adapt to this changing world or march like lemmings off a cliff? We need technical education over antiquated degrees. We need continuous education, not front-loaded based knowledge that quickly becomes obsolete. We need shorter work weeks and a greater focus on ourselves and our families. Yang's Freedom Dividend doesn't solve all our problems, obviously, but it's the best approach to assist unemployed miners and to provide a soft landing for those who will either be replaced by automation or see stagnant wages because of it. Joe Biden's recent statement that unemployed coal miners should become programmers proves he's unfit to be president. In today's world, we need someone who gets it. Biden doesn't get it, and he never will. This is Jim Wall. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Cisco, do we have to leave all our good friends now? Only until next time, Pancho. Adios, amigos. Thank <laughs> you.